Hello everybody and welcome to the Owl House Video Contest. Around a month ago, I asked you all to submit videos related to the Owl House, so today, we're gonna check them out. Before we begin though, I'd like to thank everybody who submitted. We had quite a few entries and all the creators are going to be credited down in a spreadsheet below, so please check that out. I'm sure a lot of these creators worked really, really hard on their videos, so please take a look at that list. And with that said, let's check out these videos. This is a stress toy. Anytime you feel the urge to cause chaos, just squeeze. Bruh! What the heck? Already! One video in and we're already on the flatback death jokes? You're kidding! That was pretty funny though. I don't know why that got me so good. I don't know if it was the Minecraft EXP or the freaking Sans eye at the end. Oh my gosh, Sans Belos is real. That was a good edit. Don't you talk about my mother! Aw, if only King was actually in the human realm to hang out with everybody and not being killed by Camila. <laughs> And look at what I made! These are mystical beasts called wolves, and I love them. You sink into my claw. <laughs> this is so bad. Ah, uh, that was a little odd. <laughs> Emo Hunter, I guess. That was pretty good, actually. I like the completely uncomposed singing. That's hilarious. Uh -huh. We got Captain Avery, Security Officer Quando. What's up, guys? It's Security Officer Quando. Dingo here. I have been arrested for multiple crimes. You know, when I first heard that in Thanks to Them, I was like, somebody's gonna make this joke. Somebody's gonna make this joke. And somebody did. <laughs> Call a doctor. I'm not getting cell reception. What do we do? That was literally disgusting. I, I loved the flatback at the beginning that was just like, <laughs> <laughs> just like <laughs> That was funny. And then once Lego Eat appeared, everything just went to chaos, dude. Though Marcy falling down the flight of stairs weirdly like went to the tune of the music, that was actually pretty impressive. Uh, you drama toys. I think he's hurt. Yeah, me too. I'm sure a lot of us are. Poor Luce. So with the release of Thanks to Them, it has come to my attention that this flapjack design is now out of date. If I just do this, boom, much better. Mm, nah, dude, I can already tell the majority of these videos, they're just gonna be killing Flatback, dude. Not my boy, that's my boy, dude. And it's been like two months and I'm still not over Flatback's death. You're kidding me. I love these memes. I think they're so funny. I, I, I don't know if it's just the sped up footage, but I just love these types of memes. <laughs> these are all really good. I think my favorite one has to be the Walter White falling on the ground with the draining spell. That actually fits, weirdly enough. That actually fits. <laughs> okay. Darth Vader! I know what that's from, that's from a Smash reaction, but oh my gosh, that's so funny. Star Wars! Oh my god, Star Wars! Oh my god, Star Wars! Star Wars! I hate you! Oh! Well next time, don't steal my Monopoly! Ariana, give James your $200 you landed on his property. No! He's in jail! I'm not gonna give money to a criminal! That's not how you... Bye! Mommy?
Why is brother screaming? Shut the up, Sally. You don't get to talk after stealing my last railroad. I wish I was never born. Me too. You think I wanted this? <laughs> oh my gosh, that guy got a dark at the end. There. Did you see that? Did you see that when Hunter said he was never born and showed the picture of the Grimwalker pages? Oh my gosh. I like this meme though. The Monopoly meme. It's pretty good. Aw. Just some nice fan art there. That's cute. Ooh, more fan art. You love to see it. Dude, <laughs> I like that one with the king with the drip, dude. He actually looks really clean. What the heck? These are all really good though, but I think my favorite has to be the king with the drip. I like that. Now that I am on Earth, I need to find other magic users. Let's see what we can find online. Hey, this one is cheap. Well, here we are. What is your name? My name is the Mage Accelerator, but my friends call me Mage for short. Well, what can you do? Magic. Okay, well, see ya. Am I huh? I don't get it. What happened? Oh, uh, Luce goes to a magic store, and then Mage does magic with a diamond, and then dun 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 I don't really know what happened, but I think it's funny. This is just a regular little gummy bear. Adorable! And I've decided to destroy it. No! No! What the heck? Dude, I knew it. So many of these videos, they're just gonna be killing poor Flatback. Guys, look, it's season three Flapjack. Oh, see what I mean? What the? <laughs> oh, we're just getting started too. Oh my gosh. Delicious. I am no longer a fan of Hootie. Hootie is now going on the F tier in the character tier list for the Owl House. That's right, Hootie. After what you did, F for Flapjack. I know there are a lot of low notes, but when did you hear me say you're allowed to growl like a pack of Bengal tigers? Keep it bright. Keep that smile in your mouths. The keynote is G, but it is not form of G minor, so don't root down in mud and boots. Think of words, think of heaven, and this time prove to me you can sing sharp as well as flirt. Okay, okay, okay. I, first off, have to say, before I cut on the video, I love that this was done in Flipnote Studio. If you don't know what that is, it's an animation studio that's literally on the DS. And, at least personally for me, I used to use that thing all the time. Like, all the time in the past. I love Flipnote Studio. Uh, and I'm so glad somebody actually decided to animate something in it. I think that's so cool. And having a choir of like Grimwalkers from Bellows, I think that's really funny. Like, the choir of freaking Golden Guards. That's terrifying. I like that. That's a really cool idea. And done in Flipnote Studio, amazing. Hey, Liz, have you seen my apple blood? Yes, Ida, it is in the fridge. Thanks. Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna run around and desert you. Uh-huh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I that, what? Okay. Uh, dude, my I feel like I lose brain cells when I watch these videos, but it's so funny. I love just JPEG loose PNG Ida. Ida turns around then just fridge. It's in the fridge. Oh, okay. Fridge appears. It just appears. And then <laughs> freaking Lego Ida never gonna give you up again. What the heck? Do you have Instagram? No. Snapchat? Still no. Then what do you have? A life? Oh, get destroyed, Flatback. It's over. I don't use any of those either. Do you have any force? Go fish. Loose! You're back! Oh, sure. Just ignore us. Sorry! Do you know where Ida is? She's right over there. Okay, thanks, Collector. Here, have this. <gasps> What's this? That's an iPad. You're in so Gabriel now. Okay! Okay! <laughs> I love that. Okay, at the end. 
<laughs> just accepts that he's Enzo Gabriel now. Oh, that's great. I like how it just, it's so, imagine if it's so peaceful coming back from the boiling eyes. Like, they go through all this stuff, and like, they just walk in, and then it's just they're playing Go Fish, and that's it. Like, the bowling aisles, there's like nothing wrong with it. It's completely fine. In fact, it's better than it used to be, and literally the only difference is that King and the Collector are just playing Go Fish, and that's it. That's literally the only difference. I would laugh so hard. Well, I just don't get out of that lamp very much. Is that a bow tie? I like bow ties. I haven't slept in eight days! I feel like that's kind of normal for Hunter. The premise of this little animation here is that Hunter's supposed to be on caffeine, which I think is pretty funny, but I feel like he doesn't really sleep that often either. I guess the caffeine just makes it worse. That was actually really sad. What the heck? Now I'm sad. Aww. That was really good. That was really well done. Oh, yes. 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 I love it. Yes. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, all four of them are beautiful. The One Piece is real. The pacing was a bit fast, but what happened there was Luce and Ida reuniting. And I love that because it was to the tune of Claire de Lune. I love that song. It's one of my favorite classical songs. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why? What the heck, dude? I, I, I can't. I just. Sans. 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 <laughs> I can't even lie, that edit was sick. That was fire, dude. I love Darius. I think Darius is a super cool character. Uh, awesome design, awesome character. I wish he got more screen time, but oh my goodness, dude. That was a sick edit. He always got special treatment because he was the genius teen prodigy. Oh yeah, special treatment, huh, Lilith? Genius teen prodigy. Ugh, poor Hunter. Siblings, 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 siblings. This is my sister. This is my brother. We are siblings and we care for each other. Everything we own, we always share. Because we are siblings and we have the same hair. I like knitting. And I like coins. We both came out same lines. If you don't like siblings, give us a chance. We'll impress you with our sibling dance. Oh my gosh. Uh, I don't know if that's stolen art there at the end. It very well could be, but what the heck? That was really good. I, l I love that little sibling dance meme, but the freaking default dance at the end, dude, that, that sended me. That sent me beyond. I'm not coming back. It's over. It's like you're reading each other's minds. You must have been friends forever. Ew, what? What was that? Amity's troll face? That was disgusting. I do love Kiki more in the background, just doing her own thing. Hello there, mate. Wait, what was that? Nothing. Hey, Collector, no hard feelings, right? Well, remember that time you beat me at Sorry? No. Okay, so how it went is you beat me, so now I'm gonna turn you into a pile of goop. Say goodnight. Can you not? I love how gentle the voices are, but I also love the- Remember that time you beat me at sorry? No. Just like how fast Bello says it and how gentle, just- No. I don't know what it is, but something about that just- It cracks me up so hard. 
Flapjack's death was overrated, and so is Lumity. Now get over it. You don't actually know anything. <laughs> I think the funniest part is that you use freaking Jacob, which is like a unanimously like hated character. Like he's easy to hate on, right? Like you're supposed to hate him. Oh, it's perfect. Perfectly fits the role. Hello and welcome to another episode of Cooking with Bellas. Here today we are making palisman pie cake. Step one, step two, one. Step two, take the children's bird and egg cubes. Step three, take the egg and mix it with flour and other pie crust ingredients. Brush with oil and put into pie pan. Step four, crack open a cold bird with the boars and pour it into the pie. Cover with crust. Step 5. Cut vent on top of the pie and put in the boiling sea for about a second. And step 6. Oh crap, I burnt. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm dying. I couldn't even tell like what he was saying half the time. But like three seconds in, I was like, this is art, this is it. It was like, welcome back to Bellas' cooking show. And I was like, I'm already in. I'm in, dude, I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. I'm full send, I'm in. Today we'll be making Palestine pie. And he's like, for step one, take the children's bird. It's like, what? <laughs> not even like steal. And like, just, it's so generalized. Not even like take Hunter's palace, but just take the children's bird. Oh, that's so funny. And then <laughs> crack open the cold one with the boys and Steve's there. It's like... This is it. This is top tier Owl House content. Oh my gosh. Oh, pull out my inner tomato sauce. I can do that. Hey, good morning, Uncle. How's it going? Oh, Titan. No, not again. Hunter, help me. Oh, Titan. Where are those pals when you need one? Found one. Wait, no. You did. Give me that. Wait. Goodbye, Evelyn. Ah, that's better. Thank you, Hunter. Anytime, Uncle. That that was a little fast-paced, but I did my best. <laughs> I do like that, though. He just grabs a random palisman, realizes he accidentally gives him flat back. That's depressing. Poor Hunter, dude. Okay, what does A stand for? Arson. Oh, you're so good. Okay, B. What does B stand for? Barson. <laughs> what stands for C? Commit arson. Ooh. D. Don't come near me. I'm going to commit arson. <laughs> I raised her real well. This is very accurate to season one King. As you can see, there, there's no horn, so that's definitely season one King. Very accurate. I could see King committing arson at any point in time. Personally, that's why I don't agree with your opinion. Okay, I have a counterpoint. Valid argument? No. Pipe bomb. Oh. <laughs> Pipe bomb, okay. I was expecting like a no you or a Uno reverse, but not a pipe bomb. What the heck? Jeez Louise. Wait. You, you don't remember what she looks like. Hey, just make something up. No! It's not really Bellows. It's Hunter on the inside. No! <laughs> That was a cool little edit though, I like that. Bro, just like, be better at being sad that Flapjack's dead. His name isn't Flapjack, it's Flapack. I think I know my own bird's name. It seems that you don't, because you just call him Flapjack when his real name is Flapack. Just get better. Just get better. <laughs> oh, that one was good. I like the flatback. It is flatback instead of flapjack. That's right. That's how you know the true fans. That's how you know. Love it. Hey, you. Are you subscribed to Zeus Bob Key? Oh, yeah, I definitely am. But, um, that guy, he isn't. <laughs> oh, he's ugly. <laughs> yeah, I know. But, hey. Thoughts on tomato sauce? Well, I think tomato sauce is a um, pretty cool YouTuber, and I think you should subscribe to him and Z's. Okay, I have a gun. Also, um, this is a robbery. Wait a minute. <laughs> Imagine walking in asking if you're subscribed to myself and tomato sauce. Also, it's pronounced Z's, Bob G, not Gee, but whatever. I don't really care that much. Uh, imagine walking into a place, being like, hey, are you subscribed to these YouTubers? And they're like, uh, yeah. By the way, I have a gun. This is a robbery. <laughs> what? Also, Jacob, you're not subscribed? Come on now, dude. Actually, you know what? I don't think I want Jacob to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I think he can just stay away. Yeah, go away, Jacob, actually. Unsubscribe. Ban. Actually, I'm banning Jacob right now. Jacob is officially banned from Z's G channel. Get out. Goodbye. 
Yo, that was so cool! I, I, I like the... It's like haunting, that's so spooky! I love that, that's really cool! Ooh, that's really neat. I love speed paints. I think it's always really neat to see how artists go through their like work in progress because I personally am really bad at art. So like looking at what other people do is really interesting. Uh, so this is actually really cool. I love getting to see these types of things. And also the Danganronpa music is just the sprinkles on top. Oh, uh, okay, this one's really cool. This is somebody's like little short little sketchbook tour. We have the, I promised a special kid that I would protect you from rain. Uh, I wonder how they're doing. And then the glyphs. That's really neat, I like that. Short little sketchbook tour. You're not going to die today. I'm a hunter from your world, happen to take you home. Yo, you added your own lore. After after the flatback monstrosity was created, you created a hunter monstrosity to go with that flatback monstrosity? Oh my goodness. That's adorable. Although I hate to break it to you, but that flatback is canonically dead. And also that was the original flatback, but I'm not gonna get into that. Mother. Mother, I crave violence. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I, well, that was like a roller coaster. I was expecting something terrifying with like the, the just slow ascend and then just mother. <laughs> Such a silly voice. But then her freaking, I'm guessing this is supposed to be her palisman, wants, just craves violence with a knife. Guess I should have been scared. <laughs> I argue someone adopted doesn't look like their parents. You what didn't is? say that before. That was an easy answer. You yeah. didn't say that before. Well, that's what I'm saying, but so do, do I look adopted? No, because you look like your parents. He looks like his parents. He looks like his. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> 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 well, you set me off on that one. That was, that was like an alley oop right there. There you go, mate. Like, have it. Oh, uh, good one. <laughs> 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 Okay, maybe get in this song. They're talking about how they kind of look like their parents, but then Hunter looks like Caleb and not his parents because he doesn't have parents. I don't know why he's laughing though, but whatever. I, I may have misinterpreted. Either way, it's a pretty funny little skit. This is just a lot to take in. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. This is just a lot to take in. When you're trying to help out with the groceries, I, I I know that. I know that feeling. It's all in like the back of the car. Have you ever done that thing where you like try and take all the bags at once and you're like, Ugh! you're like doing your best to like not, you know, spill anything. And if you drop one thing, your parents will get on you so hard. Gosh, dude, the memories of carrying groceries. <laughs> I'm Depart Quillen. You can't stop me. They're too powerful as we can stop them. Ida. Right? We need somebody more powerful to stop it. Why is that up to me? What? 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 I'm your god now! Heal for me! Woo! God Hootie, let's go! You love to see the God Hootie content. Also, I love that Luce is a JPEG and the rest <laughs> have their transparent backgrounds. I love I love these videos where you make these you make these videos and some, only sometimes they have the white untransparent background. Oh, it's so funny, dude. It is so funny. Hey Luce, I was looking through your phone and I found this app called Among Us. Would you care to explain it? I'm sorry, what? Okay, you can't explain it. Okay, she goes to explain it. And then for some reason, Hunter and Gus have transformed into Among Us's. Among I? Crewmates? Imposters? I don't even know what to call them. How does this adorable person... turn into this monster? Uh, 
Uh, simple, simple answer, Bellows. Bellows, mm-hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. Emperor Bellows. Philip would have mm -hmm. The guy who killed his brother. The guy who tried to commit genocide to the entire witch race. Mm -hmm. That guy, mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the one. I miss Liz the human. Hey, King, I am back and I have a surprise for you. You're crying. Oh yeah, you're back, I miss you, Luz. Hey, King, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, is this the Collector Laws? You see, it's the Cometer. Bellows, why are you talking? I hate you, you killed my bird. Flapbook, this is crying because of you. Why, Bellows, why did you kill Flapback? You're a stinky Bellows. Where is my place in five Bellows? I lost it, Hunter. Bellows, I am dead. No, 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 no. Hey, Camel, can I have a car keys, please? You see, here are my keys. Thanks, Opie, bye. <laughs> Okay, what? Okay, this is apparently after the gang returns to the Isles. So they reunite with King, they see the Collector. I love how they see the Collector and then like immediately it's on to something else. And then just everybody just starts slamming into Bellows. Like they're like, we hate you Bellows, we hate you. Like everyone's going to am on Bellows. And then at the end, V just wants the car keys back again, I guess, even though she left them there. there? Uh, I don't know, I think it's funny, especially the Bellows part though. Okay, that's actually a pretty creative idea. That's funny. So the premise is they're getting their dog to decide who they're going to destroy between Bellos and Odalia. And honestly, I'd pick Odalia too because Bellos, while being an absolutely horrible person, he's more funny to mean. All right, your your parents' email. Well, uh, if they if they're asking for it, might as well. <laughs> All right, so we got we got Dale's email in there. You <laughs> like all right, now, well, we, we got Is that his actual email address? That's Dale's actual <laughs> email address. Let's create our penguin. Let's do it. Oh, boy. Okay, well... Oh, sh Please activate your penguin account so your child can play. <laughs> can you Acti call Dale real quick? That's pretty good. I guess the Toe Gang's trying to create a Club Penguin account. Man, now I miss Club Penguin. Why'd they have to take it away, dude? Why'd they have to take away Club Penguin from us? Come on. It'd be funny to see what these characters would do on Club Penguin. That was unexpected, okay. A spider comes through the portal and then just, that was very unexpected. What is this? It's a collection of like bootleg characters with Emperor Belos, Flatback, King in a Shoe, and Lego Ida. These are all just bootleg Owl House characters. I love it. And everyone, it's Hunter from the Owl House. And today, we're going to be playing Finite Security Breach in the PS5. Tweet, tweet. Ooh! Well, Flap Jacob, what are you doing here? You know I'm doing a live stream right now. Yeah, I know. I don't think you could make it past the first scene because you're scared of everything. I will not get scared, see? I'll search a Five Nights at Freddy's jump scares right now. I won't get scared, you'll see. Mother of Titan, holy moly, help me, I'm scared. <laughs> Dude, I lost it for some reason at Flap Jaco. That's what I broke, dude. What? Flap Jaco? <laughs> Why'd the f O come from? Flap Jaco? <laughs> Oh gosh, that's, that's Liddy Markiplier, dude. Scariest game of all time. That's what Wood Hunter would put, yep. Hey, Terry, you want some? Bird. Empty. <laughs> this bird, empty. <laughs> oh, poor Flatback got yeeted. Not my boy. Hey, Google. Hi, you guys. Hootie here, and I'm just gonna tell you that I made my old song. <laughs> Ugh, sorry, I got jump scared there at the end. 
<laughs> that was cute. That was a cute little song. Hootie made a little song. That's actually adorable. Great song, Hootie, and great song from the creator as well. It says it's because this house isn't pretty enough, but I think it's because there is a bit of hospital. Guys, let's be honest, this house ain't much prettier. I think this might be the worst week ever. Dad left me this book. I can't wait to read it. I love that, I love that so much. Look what I got at the convention. I'm gonna cut my hair with it. This was a bad idea. If don't tell me you actually cut your hair with that saw. Did you actually do that? That's dangerous. That's actually dangerous. I do think that's actually really cool though. Well, besides the dangerous part of it, I do think that's really cool that you like recreated Luce's video entries. That's actually really cool. Props to you. Now please be careful when using stuff like that, I must say. Look, his mom was probably at the grocery store next door and he just got done with swimming lessons and he said something like, mother, I would be most grateful if you let me consume a pastry with high levels of sugar and simple carbohydrates. And his mom probably said, yeah, whatever, nerd. Go get something at Suabway. Pastry with high amounts of sugar and simple carbohydrates? What the heck? That is very overly verbose, King. My goodness, I didn't even know you knew words like that. Okay, now that I've got my PS5 back, I can finally relax again. <laughs> you again? How do you know where I live? Let's say a little illusion boy told me your address. Now if you don't mind me, I'll just... <laughs> The up tastes like plastic and metal. Why? Hootie just comes in and is just like, all right, that's it. You know what I'm going to do today? I'm going to be a menace. I'm going to eat your PS5, look you straight in the face and be like, yep, I just did that. Tastes like metal and plastic. Dude, Hunter can't even catch a break. That was amazing art, by the way. I thought that was amazing. I even got jump scared by the Hootie at the beginning. Hey guys, today we are going to be creating my persona. Let's have a look. I really like this one. I'm gonna get it. Several days later. Guys, my first foot arrived. Hunter, what the heck? Ah. Uh, okay, that was a thing. <laughs> it's just Hunter, what the heck? What happened? Hunter, is that your persona? That's cringe! You're cringe! I love that meme so much. Huh? Palisman! Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, that caught me off guard so hard. Oh my gosh. That was good. That was good. I I, I can't I gotta give it up. That one was actually just good. That was just a really good one. I think they both look good. I think all art is good. Although the hoodie is a little terrifying, I won't lie. Hey, Luz, what are you doing? It's Mormon time. I'm so disappointed, but so happy that you included the Breaking Bad music. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. I love it when people do these like pixel art. Pixel art is like really cool and really complex. That's actually super sick. Even did like the whole little animation and everything. That's awesome. That was a nice little edit. I have to say there were lots of edits submitted into this contest. And I hate to say it, that I did have to exclude quite a few of them because so many of them had copyrighted music. But there are also a lot of edits that had copyrighted music that felt like they needed to have that copyrighted music in order for the edit to work. So unfortunately I had to exclude uh, edits like that. But again, it was in the rules that you couldn't include copyrighted music. So either way, this is a very nice edit. Sorry, just I felt like I had to make that clear. Or honestly, I was thinking the most likely one to die uh, I was think I was talking about this earlier in my last video was Flapjack because Bellus is gonna be targeting Palisman 
and maybe all the palace men will die. And like, he's definitely gonna be targeting Flapjack mainly, right? And Flapjack is the main one that he has a grudge with considering it was Caleb's palace men and is now also hunters. So I, I was talking about how Bellas has so many threats in the last video and Flapjack is definitely gonna be the main palace men he'll wanna go after. <laughs> that, was, that was good, that was good. I like that, that was pretty good. Not just because I was in it, but I think just this freaking vine boom every time. Flapjack, <laughs> slapback. <laughs> I laughed too hard at vine boom, dude. It's so easy. I'm so easy to please. Like, you can literally just play vine boom and I'll smile. You ever heard of gaslighting? That's like my specialty. I'm the devil. Did you know that? Hi, nice to meet you. I'm the devil, Sonic. I already know who you are. You kissed that girl that one time? Oh, gaslight me! Gaslight me! Uh, I already am. I was gaslighting you this whole time. <laughs> oh, cool! Shut up. <laughs> Oh, it's great. I love that. That's uh, that's from the freaking snap cube sonic dub. That's from their shadow dub Oh my gosh, that's amazing and the artwork to go with it. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Oh my gosh That's really cool <laughs> Bellas would gaslight people too. He did. He literally did gaslight people. That is his specialty. What the heck? Hello everybody, it is time for yet a- Alright, so there, there was so much suspense and build up, which was actually really good. The light bulb at the start was a really cool shot. I don't know if you did that, if that was taken from somewhere. That looked really cool. And then just, ugh, I, I cringed at the end because it was my own voice. But the Bella's default dance is pretty funny though. Imagine like he creeps up on you and that's just what he starts doing. That's not even the default dance. What even dance is that? It's just a Fortnite dance. I just realized something. I had a bad childhood. Yeah, I know. What do you mean, you know? Look at you. What do you mean, look at me? Look at how you stand. People who had good childhoods don't stand like that. Aw, oh, no. Poor Hunter. Come on, guys. Take it easy on him. Not my boy. Dude, Hunter and Flatback are getting the short end of the stick in this contest, dude. They really are. I mean, I can't blame anybody for doing that, but still. My ears hurt. I won't lie, they do hurt. But when they said wiped out Flapjack, dude, I lost it. Also, at the start, it was just Lego Eda for like six, seven seconds. I was like, it, please tell me it's not 30 seconds of just this. <laughs> that was pretty good though, but it did hurt my ears. Aw, another speed paint, that's so good! That was like really speedy too, I couldn't even really see the process, but that was cool! I love speed paints, dude, I think they're so sick. And Lucid King, dude, they need to be reunited, I can't wait. I told you all your dreams could come true, and you just have to leave your home, friends, and family forever. You even play Flyer Derby on your day off! Well, this year, yeah. Oh, you just pull that cord above your head. Oh, thank you. Hi. That's my boy, dude. I love these edits. Some of these edits are really, really clean. That one was really solid. I love it when people actually include, like, clips of voices in their edits. I think that just makes it so much better. Oh, that was sick. That was good. Another good edit. Uh, odd choice of music. Very odd. <laughs> it's a freaking like alarm that wakes you up in the morning. I don't know. Camera work was nice though. I like that. If your leg get cut off, would it hurt? Duh. How though? Cause your leg got cut off, fool. Where you go for the pain? In your leg. Exactly, bruh. How you go for the pain in your leg if your leg is gone? If your leg is gone. <laughs> I love that meme, dude. Oh, that's so good. That's actually like the perfect two characters to do it with, too. Oh, that's so funny. 
Uh, the hunter realizing it slowly, like, oh my gosh, because your leg is gone. Oh, I love it. That was so good. And like the animatic, the way it was done with like the drawings and the transitions, that was really good. That was really solid. I love that. Yes, this mama is ready for trauma. She was not ready for trauma. Very true. Very true indeed. <laughs> Uh, uh that was nice. It's, it's good to see everybody all grown up. The Owl House characters really have gone through a lot of design changes, which is pretty cool because you don't really see that in a lot of other cartoons. You usually just have like one design and you stick with it, but like the Owl House kind of goes through lots of changes. Love to see it. Nah, dude, I was prepared to cry my heart out. And now I'm crying my heart out in a different way because I got freaking Lego Eda! <laughs> Together, there is no challenge that can hold us back. <gasps> Are you kidding me? This, this freaking, they have the exact same energy as the last video. Just, just death. That was sadder than the last video. Oh my gosh. Rip Amity, she's dead. That's all it takes. One trip and you're gone. It's over, Enzo Gabriel. No, you are over Lice the human. It's Luz. You musty, dusty, crusty iPad kid. A no reverse card, teehee. Fine. I'll use my ultra super duper special move. Ella Shankla. La what? No woo woo. Yay! Now. Wa wa wa. Hey Zs. I really like your content so well done on your achievements. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that was- I love how you used like an actual like toddler's voice for freaking the collector and then is defeated using the Lechonkla. What the heck? Oh my gosh, that was so weird, but so good. Also, Lice the human? Ugh. I would hate to be named Lice. Yo, that's actually really cool. I like that. That's the second Lego flatback that's appeared in this video. That's so cool. Look at him. It actually looks really good. I don't even... What? What is this? Bellows, Hunter, and Loose in the back room? With the creatures and, and the cr crabs? Uh, okay, that's the thing. Very weird. <laughs> so apparently this is Amity smoking and then just loose face palms because of it. But it's made in SFM, which is actually like, Pretty cool. I don't think I've ever seen any Owl House SFM, so that's actually pretty cool. I know animation in those can't be easy. At least I wouldn't think so. I've never actually used it, so. That, that's pretty cool, though. That actually is pretty cool. No fight left. Or did you learn your lesson from last time? You wish. That's pretty good. I like how they included all the best animated Owl House fights, but there actually aren't too many. I wish they put in the Lilith versus Ida. That's probably one of my favorite fights in the entire show. I think it probably is my favorite fight. Yeah, it probably is actually. I think that's probably my favorite, but that was a pretty solid edit. What happens if you try to mix four glyphs together at once? Let's try it. Here lies the idiot who tried to mix four glyphs together at once. In the explosion, a ring pop candy was made. R.I.P. Child. Hootie! <laughs> I love how it just immediately cuts to just death. <laughs> also, the ring pop? 
Well, I don't know what that's about, but that's pretty good. It's just, oh, what happens when you combine four glyphs? I don't know, but here's a ring pop, I guess. <laughs> Aw, so a little context, this is Hunter's sensory overload, because he's not used to like, you know, being touched or having friendship, so like, ugh, oh, that's a sensory overload for him, the poor guy. The Emperor needs you alive and well for the day of unity, but until then, night night. Where am I? Rain becomes Spider-Man? Okay, I guess I see it. I guess I see it because like the the shape that it made on the head. That's kind of neat How I've missed the smell of the boiling aisles Actually, I'm, I'm so pumped up right now. I can fight the entire Titan myself. Give me your skin ah! Ew, not that freaking fairy from the first episode. Ew, give me your skin. I hate that thing Even Camila was so shocked that she just freaking fell over <laughs> Okay, what else, future me? Well, you know Amy. Yeah, I was gonna save her from drowning in a lake. Let Ooh. drown. Yeah, let him drown, let him drown. <laughs> let Bellows drown, dude. Oh my gosh, don't go anywhere near that guy. Okay, so this is a cute little gotcha life thing i'm not really too familiar with the gotcha life stuff but apparently it's just a nice little lumity moment and they fall over <laughs> and then just at the end and so gabriel just chilling there stealing our phone how dare you an unrelated note did you ever find your dad mm, nope nope no 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 i'm not gonna comment on something like that what the heck Hunter? Thanks to them in 30 seconds. Yeah, Hunter and Camille learns everything. Time skip. Assume that her mom gets a new style. Cute little rain scene. Find a weird school thing decide to go investigate. Luz finds kinship with a fictional character. Luz, my goop. Camille tries so hard to make everyone feel at home followed by Camille trauma. Hot low, hot low, hot low. And me nails Visha. Cute little sibling to a moment. Halloween costumes and oh, um. Okay. Oh, yeah. Now we have this backstory stuff. Okay, this is just past and present Luz angst. And oh, now we're just going back to something going on Hunter. And Luz can do freaking magic in the human world now, I guess. And what's going on with Hunter? Oh, my Titan, look at that fight scene in the animation. No. No, 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 and then they're like, it's not Camille, save some, but no! And we go to the boy house. Okay, bye. That was genuinely impressive. I spent like 30 seconds talking about like a pixel on a screen and you can do the entire thanks to them? Why aren't you running this channel? What the heck? My freaking thanks to the video is 50 minutes long. I could have made it 30 seconds with your help. What the heck? <laughs> no, I'm just playing, but that was actually pretty impressive to summarize things. I'm terrible at summaries, so nice job. Hey, Hunter, want to hear a joke? Yeah, sure. That'll make me feel better. My obese bird died yesterday! It was a real weight off my shoulder! <gasps> Whoa! What did I say? Flatback wasn't that fat. Even for me, that's harsh. You meanie! That joke was so bad I came back from the dead. It was a good joke! No, it was mean! I'm about to hit you harder than the collector! <laughs> what the heck? That's actually so mean of Luz to make a joke like that right after it happened. Come on now. And then Flatback comes back to life because the joke was so bad. Holy moly. That's just Lego Eda dancing! What? What? <laughs> What? What? That's just her dancing in explosions. Is it really that simple? I guess it's that simple. Hello? Hey, what's up? I need your help. Can you come here? Ugh, I can't. I'm buying clothes. All right, well, hurry up and come over here. I can't find them. There's only soup. What do you mean there's only soup? It means there's only soup. Well, then get out of this soup aisle. There's more soup. What do you mean there's more soup? There's just more soup. Go into the next aisle. There's still soup. Where are you right now? I'm at soup. What do you mean you're at soup? I mean I'm at soup. What store are you in? I'm at the soup store. Why are you buying clothes at the soup store? Ah, uh, the classic soup. I love this freaking joke, dude. I've seen it done a thousand times. This one is amazing as well. I love the hunt PNG hunter with like the actual you know, well drawn loose, and then there's the hunter PG is just flying around the whole time. That's amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's so good. I love how they animated the little PNG making it just fly around. That's so funny. Okay, listen, I'm gonna snap my fingers, and you will forget that you were ever gay. That was never gay. That's neat. That's a cute little animation. 
The mouth movements are very over-exaggerated. I'm a big fan of over-exaggerated mouth movements. Yeah, I love exaggerated animation, but that, <laughs> that ending was pretty funny. It's time to stop subtly hinting to people that you like them, because they won't pick up on it. Instead, hit them with the, hey baby, won't you look out? <laughs> that was pretty cute. That was actually well animated, dude. Oh my gosh, these animation entries are so impressive. Gosh, you people are so talented. That's a pretty clean edit, I gotta say. I love like the slow-mo and like the altered colors and the shaking screen. That was solid. Nice edit. I like it, Kaji. Amity? Me? On a team with you? <laughs> Running around in cute uniforms? <laughs> Sweating? I gotta go! Huh. <laughs> I knew it was coming, I knew it was coming, but just like, the anticipation. Oh, it was so good. I love the World of Light memes. Please, bring it back. Bring back the World of Light memes, they're so funny. <laughs> that was so well done what the heck that was amazingly animated oh my gosh that was so good and then just like the i might be a plant will is like mm, plant i wonder if magic will work on you <laughs> that was so well done oh my gosh that was amazing oh that's adorable you have the Owl House gang doing the Peanuts dance. That's so cute. Having Willow as Marcy really fits, honestly. That's that's really good. I've always loved these dances. They're so classic and iconic and so cute. Is seeing the Owl House characters do it, dude? That's just so adorable. What the f is that? MC Donalds? Hello, hello. I'll get to McDonald's. What can I get you, sir? Hmm. Can I have the, uh, Happy Mail? Of course, sir. Here is your Happy Mail. Hmm. I'm not going back to the demon realm. That was so good! Oh my gosh! That reminds me of that freaking SpongeBob episode where Squidward, you know, the one where he like gets obsessed over the Krabby Patties, but that like eating animation where he just flops, <laughs> flops on the ground or flops on the burger, eats it. That's so good, dude. He gets he becomes so obsessed with cheeseburgers. He's never got to experience some McDonald's Big Mac. Oh gosh, dude. Imagine that's how you save the world. You got this evil overlord Bellows, and once he experiences the gloriousness of a cheeseburger, he's like, yeah, you know what, actually, I think I'm just gonna have these cheeseburgers instead. I've got my fulfillment for the cheeseburgers and not murdering witches. I wonder how Ida and King are doing. I still don't know who they are. Hey now, you're an all-star, get your game on, go play. Hey now, you're a rock star, get the show on. Get I don't know why it was so good, so well tuned, and <laughs> Rain is dying! Look at them! They're dying! <laughs> Help them! What the heck? Uh, like Oida! Blows up pancakes with mine. No! I mean, pancakes aren't exactly how I get his flapjack, but no! Stop killing flapjack! Me and my Ida. Ida doesn't wear any pants. I don't know what, <laughs> why it was accompanied by music like that for telling Ida to wear pants, but okay. <laughs> post traumatic stress disorder, post traumatic stress disorder, post traumatic stress disorder. I need a therapist. <laughs> Internal power. <laughs> 
<laughs> Ow, I am in pain. <laughs> that's great to leave it off on. Dude, the freaking bell is coming up from behind them. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, that's so good. L Luce and Hunter coming together, realizing that they're just both endlessly traumatized by bellows. That's so good. <gasps> yes! Okay, so we got awesome Darius being a dad. Hunter points out that Bellus is the one who did this to him. Darius shoves him into the freaking lake so that he has to go back and fish with Hootie. You'll love to see it, dude. Hootie and Bellus fishing will never die. Family Guy death pose, dude. Not the Family Guy death pose, no. That was really good though, dude. That was so clean. That animatic was so clean. Oh my gosh, I love how that worked. I think this is like an animation or animatic trend that was happening. Cause I feel like there's another entry regarding this, but that was really good. I'm gonna be just like you. No matter what you say I can do. I'll follow you until the day I can smile at you. Hey, big brother, I'm just like you. That was actually terrifying. Really well done. Really well done. It's it's the story of Philip and Caleb, and then it's just oh gosh, dude. And we know what happens. That song actually fits well. Gosh, that's terrifying. Wow. Really well done though. Really well done. That is pretty fitting. That is pretty fitting for each character, especially like Willow with the plants and Gus with like, you know, the stem and outer space stuff. That's cool. I didn't really play Animal Crossing. It doesn't really interest me that well, but that actually is really cool. I like that. Industrial society. La, no more possums. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 Industrial. It's been 84 years. And we've made no progress on the portal. <laughs> I'll show you that I am an awesome girl. It's a sign. Come on, Flapjack. This isn't funny. <gasps> huh? Whoa. You good? No. That. Please change. <laughs> Dude, I love YouTube poops so much. I consume YouTube poops for like 12 hours when I was younger, like uh, every day on a daily basis. They're so funny. This is great, dude. This is King of Demons again un with another YouTube poop. You'll love it, dude. I love the just, uh, there's no possums. Possum screams, oh, okay, stands, and then just, just leaves. <laughs> it's just every everything about this is so good, dude. Everything is so amazing. I love it. Okay, well, I guess Gus gets paid. That was actually really cool. Okay, it's a little difficult to tell. It doesn't show up too well, but it's a stop motion with these Legos, which I love, because I used to create these all the time, too. I know they're, they're pretty difficult to make, but it's supposed to be the boiling rain, and so they just melt because of it. That's so cool. So you like slowly take away pieces to like show that they're melting and like add in the water. That's actually really cool. That's a really cool idea. I love stop motions, but they're really hard to make. Props to you for making this. You millennial leftists who never lived one day under nuclear threat can now reflect upon your woke sky. What? Not the freaking Senator Armstrong meme, dude. <laughs> and then the, the draining spell. Oh my gosh, dude. I can imagine Bellow saying this though, I really could. What's 9 plus 10? 21. You stupid. Hey! You stupid. I think I know where to go next.
Dude, oh my gosh, another YouTube poop. I love it. Oh, it's so good. The cut to the freaking Freddy Fazbear's pizza. I lost it, dude. I, I, I got sent. I was down. I was over. It was over. <laughs> Get out. Okay. Huh? Okay, well, the first 20 seconds, the hoodie vomits up Spamton. Spamton. I don't even know what. How do you pronounce his name? Is it Spamton or Spamton? I don't actually know. And and then and and, and then other things? Uh, a grave, a rip flatback. We have Roblox Baller. Uh, a hop pop on Luce's head that is screaming, and then. Get out of here, spam t I don't know what's happening, and I think I'm okay with that. Aw, oh, no. So, a little context. This is Hunter being toasted by the collector. Why being toasted of all things? I don't know, but poor Hunter again, getting the short end of the stick. You hate to see it, but also good job. That was a good comic. How to act when you see an attractive person. Make eye contact. Now look down, hold one, two, slowly look back, now look away. Soft smile, scratch your neck, lick your lips. Now look them up and down, now lick your teeth, and snap. Ew! <laughs> Ew, that was disgusting! Ew! It's well made, of course, really well made, especially like that grin at the beginning. That was really good. Obviously, it's a joke, but oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> that ending. <laughs> Zeke said to make a Owl House video. How about the Owl House D's nuts? Now, if you don't mind, I am looking for a PS5. Caleb, please go. I am trying to find a way to possess you. There's so much wrong with this video. Oh my gosh. First off, you're calling Hunter Caleb. I know that's the joke. But Zeke? Zeke said? Who's Zeke? How'd you know my real name? What the heck? What the Ooh. Where am I? I don't know where we're flying. No, it's not way to be gay. Yes, I'm gay, and I stand Hunter. Bellows, why Ooh. are you here? I'm gonna kill you literally. Comment me. Ooh. Hi, guys! Hi, Bellows! My best friend! Are we going fishing later? You better! You better be going fishing later, that's right! <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I know, I've, I'm obsessed with the Texas speed stuff, it's so funny. I like how Bellis is just trying to confront Hunter, but Hootie's just like, Nope! We're going fishing! Ha ha ha! Hello, what is your name? My name is Owen Sarah. Did you just get your eyebrows done today? Yes, do they look great? Yes, they look very good. On a scale of 1 to 10, how do you rate your eyebrows? 11. 11? 11. That wasn't on the scale. It's above the scale, it's how good they look. Why are your eyes so red? It, were you crying? Yeah, I was crying about how much I missed my... Girlfriend. Who's your girlfriend? Natalie. Where is she? Behind the camera? No, she is not. You're right, I can't see because I'm getting blinded right now. Uh huh. Honestly, I gotta say, missed opportunity for not saying Flapjack, how much I missed my bird, my palisman, my boy Flapjack. But still, that was pretty funny. I like the transitions. I don't know if that was like a template that somebody used, but I do like the transitions that they use with the photos. They use really good photos too, to, you know, with the expressions. That was pretty good. I'm not telling them that. Oh! You're gonna hate me. What? Well, of course. <laughs> These are mystical beasts called wolves, and I love them. Gosh, I miss your life too. Sounds like after the hayride. I'm going to kill everyone. I thought this one was another lost cause. Skip it a button, Dada. <laughs> Yes, some of the YouTube poop, you'll love to see it. And even rip flatbacks in there. Amazing, amazing. Not even flapjack, specifically flatback. That's how you know it's a true fan. Great though, amazing, amazing YouTube poop. So uh, when is the Owl House game? So uh, collector buddy, Ida. It's a game about murder hoot hoot. Buddy, what are you? FBI, open up. That was fun. What next? 
You've just killed people. Now we launch a new coot hoot! Hey. I like this bird worm. Not again! <laughs> Dude, this, this is literally the chaos trio. These three cannot be put together. If they are, chaos ensues. Oh my gosh. That is li oh, I can't. I can't even, dude. I just imagine the potential of these three, like, were let loose. It it's over. This literally would happen. They would blow up the bowling aisles. <laughs> Listen, Loose. We need to take down Hop Dog. He has killed many. We just need to think of a plan. You got any ideas? I'm going to use myself as bait and you will take Hop Pop down. I know it will be tough, but I know you can do it. You are the strongest which I know. Foolish child! Thinking you could hide from your dear old Hop Pop. Now I'm going to get you. Amity, no. I guess I'll die now. Don't worry, Amity. I'll call an ambulance. One life saving surgery later. Now that you're discharged from the hospital, what do you want to do? I want to play on Hunter's PS5. Ian. That was a masterpiece. I <laughs> that was actually a masterpiece. The freaking the animation was so clean, the lip syncing, and then just <laughs> oh, Pop coming out of the tree, dude. I died. I lost it. Foolish child, dude. Oh my gosh. That could be a meme template, dude. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, that's amazing. That, that is so good. And then the freaking Family Guy death pose again with Amity. Oh, it's just, this is it. This, this is perfect. This is top tier outhouse content. It truly is. Oh my gosh, I can't get over <laughs> Foolish Child! <laughs> Red Robin, yum! Oh no! No! <laughs> that was actually pretty good. Aw, oh, Red Robin, you poor little bird. Poor little flapper. That's how you get got? Aw, oh, no, that was so clean though. That art was so clean. Yeah, me too. If I, I, if I saw a, <laughs> I can't even comprehend my brain like broke seeing that. The possum just going, oh, <laughs> I, I, I don't know, dude. I would just, I would leave. A little quick, but the context is apparently Hunter convinces Gus to play on the PS5. And apparently one week later, he gets obsessed with Fortnite. And then they drop a Lego Ida skin. Right at the perfect time. What the heck? Can we get Ida in Fortnite? Hey, Bellows. What do you want, Collector? What does that say over there? It says Joe. Oh, Joe, Mom. I like how Bellows is just hanging from the ceiling, just like, yeah, what's up, Collector? What's up? Oh, that just says Joe. Oh, <laughs> it just says Joe on the wall. <laughs> Oh, that's great. That's so amazing. Tom, have you seen my copy of the greatest movie of all time? 17 again? Yeah. Pretty sure it fell in the hole. What hole? Oh my god! What is that? There's a hole. Uh, yeah, I can see that. What's it doing there? Well, I woke up this morning. Then there was a hole. Where is your girlfriend? Tom, where is your girlfriend? She's at work. Oh. <laughs> Where's she work? In the hole. No, not in the hole. Get out of there, Flatback. Oh, gosh. That was good. That was a good comic. I like that. Oh, my gosh. People put so much effort into these. I love it. I've beaten Sword and Shield. I've filled the Pokédex and done all the side quests. Can I please have Scarlet and Violet now? You promised you would get it after I finish Shield. Don't worry, Collector. I will get it as soon as the Day of Unity is dealt with. Oh, but, but you said, you said I would have it as soon as I finish S.H.I.E.L.D. Like I said, Collector, the training spell must be completed before you earn your reward. You can trust me. You better not be fibbing or I'll break your kneecaps when I'm free. This guy needs to go touch grass. Who just told me to touch grass? What? <laughs> Dude, that was great. The voice acting, that was awesome. Oh my gosh, I like <laughs> the Collector just wants to play Scarlet and Violet. Trust me, dude, it's a good game. The Collector should play it. And anyone who else, anyone else wants to play it, I highly recommend it. Good game. Don't listen to the haters. It's really good. After Caleb died, he became a ghost. 
And he was like, why am I a ghost? And the ghost fairy was like, well, you must have unfinished business. And for years, he wondered what in the world that could have been. Until Evelyn died and she became a ghost. And they had their little moment. And so for years, they just spied on Grimwalkers, because why not? And also very well-known family members. And Hunter and his friends wondering what crazy adventures they'll go on next. This one's actually really neat because it's just Caleb and Evelyn following through uh, the Owl House gang in their adventures. Because it's funny, it's like Caleb and Evelyn were the ones who guided them from the grave uh, after they already passed. I think that's just really cool. <laughs> Willow, are you okay? No, because <laughs> everybody forgot about me and the only thing I had to have an episode I, I shared with them. <laughs> and then my only purpose is to be shared with them. There, there. Okay, it's a little difficult to tell what Willow is saying. But basically, what's happening is she's upset that she doesn't get an episode focused on her. And the only episode that she does get is one that she co-stars in with Hunter. And now her entire point of her character is to be shipped with Hunter. And that's why she's crying. Poor Willow. <laughs> and Gus, dude. Both of them need more screen time. They really did. I feel like they kind of got a little shafted. But, you know, there's, they, if, if season three wasn't cut short, I'm sure it would have got a lot more time to open up into their characters. But, unfortunately, we did not. Shut up. She was trying to help. She even betrayed the Emperor for you. What? The Golden Guard. He knows we were in there. I can't... I can't go back! Coven was my dream. It's okay, it's okay. He's not a scout anymore. Did I read that right? <laughs> Basically everyone on a poster left. Yeah, because they all realized that Bello sucks. Except for Odalia. Odalia wasn't on a poster though, so I guess she's going to be sticking with him. <laughs> gonna be just like you, like you, no matter what you say I can do, I'll follow you until the day I can smile at you and say, big brother, I'm just like you. Oh gosh, this song has so much potential. This one was also crazy dark, just like the other one. Instead of Caleb and Philip, this time it's Hunter and Bellos. Oh, that was messed up. Especially when the song started getting dark and it showed like the hollow mind scenes and Flapjack dying. Oh my gosh, that. Oh. Oh, oh that gives me like, that gives me those tingles. Oh gosh, that was good. That was really well made. Wow, great art. I have too many leftovers. This one's simple enough. I like this. It's like Lego the Owl House, except we have uh, Golden Guard with a little light glyph, a bunch of little lights coming off of it. That's actually really neat. It's like a little mini poster, but made out of Legos. And they also have one for the abridged with the PS5 instead of the light glyph. You'll love to see it. <gasps> Luz, what time is it? Oh god, dude. <laughs> not, not freaking Lego Ida in your nightmares. I've seen so many entries of Lego Ida now, now she's probably gonna appear in my nightmares. Haha, -ha, I've got the bird now, and now I'm going to crush it. I'm never gonna let you kill Flapjack. Well, even though Hugging Hunter didn't work, it's time to play Hunter's favorite songs. Do you really think playing Hunter's favorite songs will work? I bet he has some cringe stuff like Evanescence. Die. <laughs> oh, it's pretty good. So for some context, this one's actually pretty deep, I think. Uh, if you're wondering why Darcy from Amphibia is there, it's because there is a post, a drawing that Matt Brawley, the creator from Amphibia made on his Twitter.com where he says that Darcy likes listening to Evanescence. So when Bellos makes the joke about Evanescence, that's when Darcy comes in and is like, hey, yo, Evanescence is actually good. Die. <laughs> Ew, no, 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 no. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Cooked flapjack. You're never gonna see it, kid. Never gonna see it. In the morning, instead of screaming, 
It'll do this. Together, there is no challenge that can hold us back. Good work. It's dead. <laughs> what do you mean, Willow? What do you mean, good work? That's your pal. Oh my gosh, dude. Another YouTube poop. You'll love to see it. Gosh, I love YouTube poops so much. The freaking Grunkle Stan one got me good. That was actually a good transition, too. <laughs> no more capitalism, hoot! <laughs> dude, he's killing Tibbles. Look at him, dude. Tibbles is freaking dead. It's over. I wish I got the jump on him first. Today I'm playing rock, paper, scissors with my cat. Rock, paper, scissors. Aw, oh, no. Ghost, don't do it. Don't do it to him, Ghost. No, he needs Palisman to get along with him after what happened. Come on now. Freaking Marky face at the end there. Aw, that was so cute, dude. I was not expecting that when it hatched. That was a good hatching animation. And then out came a little walrus. That's actually adorable. I would be okay with it. I'm honestly okay with whatever Lucius Palisman turns into. That was really clean animation. Very solid. And adorable. Oh my gosh, the animation on that was so quick, but so good. So it's a little quick, but what we see is Philip and Caleb. And Caleb tries to prank Philip by becoming a, putting on a little witch hat, trying to spook Philip. Philip runs away, and then Evelyn burns off the hat, and then Flapjack's over there too. That's actually so much happening within the span of just a little bit. That was really good. You'll love to see the Hunter edits, dude. Oh my gosh. I have such a bias toward the Hunter edits, dude. They're so clean. The drawing of Emily at the end was pretty nice, too. Grabs a jar of fishing bait while Hootie gets fishing gear. That is a weird combo. That is really weird. Hey, Bellows! Good for it! You wanna catch some mackerels? What the hell is a mackerel? What's a fish? I eat bugs! I can eat you if you want! N no, that that's not necessary. Yeah. Oh gosh, the <laughs> Oh gosh, the hoodie at the end there. That was such a jump scare. I love that. By the way, for those who don't know, there's a sequel to that video coming out around a month from now. Please watch the Smash Bros video with Tomoda Sauce that I did if you want to see some more context on that. Either way though, love this entry. Really solid little comic. Bruce. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. On days like these, which is like you, she'll be dwelling in the aisles. Starting with that! Get it Don't talk to me. Oh my gosh, the get dunk on for freaking Bellas of all things. That was actually a pretty solid edit with the Undertale and like the the setup that was there. That was actually pretty cool. I love this song. <laughs> D pulls a little prank using Willow's face. Oh, that's pretty good. I wonder if she actually would do that. I feel like she could. Okay, how do I land this thing? Hmm. Oh, you just pull that cord above your head. Oh, thank you. Hi. Good to see you too, human. That's so accurate, though. That's so that's so accurate with like pretty much any fan base, dude. Any fan base is like, hey, before something happens, we're just like, where's the leaks? Where's the leaks? And then sometimes we're like, no, don't show me the leaks. Don't show me them. I don't want to get spoiled. It's 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 a rough world out there with the leaks, dude. It really is. Can you see the dark? Can you fix a broken chair? Oh yes, the Giga Chad meme. You can never go wrong with the Giga Chad meme, dude. It's so good. Oh, it's so good. Giga Gus, Giga Willow, and Giga Hootie. All three of them.
I don't know what the point of that entry was. It's funny, it's cute, and Christmas is right around the corner, so I guess it fits. Also, yeah, I guess this is a good time to say happy holidays. Christmas and other holidays are happening slash are almost happening. So yeah, happy holidays, everybody. There's a bunch of memes. You know, can't go wrong with the memes. I think my favorite one is probably just the Join the Emperor Cummins today. If those kids could read, they'd be very upset. <laughs> they would be. What a beautiful day, Hoot Hoot! <laughs> that hurt! King, what are you doing here? Hurry, help! No time to explain! He's after me! Run! Who are you, Hoot Hoot? Yes, a Gabriel! my name and I love to play games. Let's play the magic snap game. No, not Hootie and King. They got freaking Thanos snapped. Dude, not the chaotic trio again, but the collector King and Hootie, I swear. Every time those three get together, something chaotic happens. Oh, oh. He's never gonna learn to read. Oh, oh. Never gonna breathe. Oh, oh. Going to jail, guaranteed. And she's a freaky monster. Yes, there's a problem. I'm the solution. Darwin had a theory called evolution. He put it into words, but it's plain to see. We need a little less of them. A little more of me. <laughs> okay, Luz. I'm pretty sure that's what this world needs from a musical. And I like how they use the freaking Texas speech to cover up over the copyright. That's pretty good. And then freaking Darwin from The Amazing World of Gumball. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Gosh, the Darwin uh, Gumball is such a funny show, dude. I highly recommend anyone who hasn't seen it. That show is like top tier comedy. Anyway, amazing entry. Very good entry. <laughs> yeah, that's actually pretty accurate. <laughs> oh, that's pretty accurate. I mean, eh. There, there's some there's some moments there's some moments but yeah normally you know when you're making it a bridge series you got to make it more comedic than anything else so come on but i don't need you anymore Yeah, see, it, it's part of the trend. Even there's like another one that did it. Look at that. The freaking like dodging thing with the dance. That's that's pretty cool. And I though I have to get out rhythm music because I'm pretty sure it's copyrighted, but uh, it's usually a song called Forest that's like slowed down. So yeah, that's like that's like the trend, but that was pretty solid. Really solid animation. I like that. So this one's really interesting because there's basically the alternate universe where the Toe characters are dragons. And it's interesting because this person also entered in the art contest with a uh, Luce and Amity dragon. So now we see that they actually animated them. That actually looks really cool. Seeing like the designs of like the dragon versions. I just think that's really cool just on its own. The collector dragon, dude. I popped off seeing that, dude. Look at the wings, dude. That's so cool looking. Oh my gosh. Pretty cool looking, dude. I gotta say, a nice little animatic slash animation combo. That was neat. Legalize nuclear bombs. That's just adorable. That's straight up just adorable. I don't get the legalized nuclear bombs. I haven't heard that one before. Am I too old? I might just be too old. I haven't seen that. But that dance is adorable, though. I love it. Yeah, I'm gonna touch this bird. Oh, I forgot I took this chicken. Give me money! Every old white man is secretly an alien. That was a memory that I blocked out of my memory. No! And stealing it. Haha, <laughs> thievery! At least my dead body made it. Don't be middle-aged. That's a poor life decision. Minimize your pain. I ran into the wall again. Just thought you should know. 
<laughs> That's really good. A bunch of incorrect Yow House quotes. Apparently the creator uh, had their friend make quotes for this and then they just like use the text to speech to actually make them say it. That's so funny, dude. My favorite one is the, I forgot I took this chicken. <laughs> Chicken, dude. Oh, it's so funny. Oh. Mm. oh, this isn't the demon realm. No, the spell didn't work. The the, the portal that Bellows made. Oh. I need to find everyone. This room looks promising. Maybe there's something in here. Maybe, just maybe. Wait, uh, is that a PS? It's a PS5! You know what? Um, um, maybe I won't find everyone. Maybe I'll just sit here for a bit. Ah. Oh, I've got the controller. Ah. Time to play on the PS5. Woo! Let's go. Me too, Hunter. Me too. <laughs> Immediately comes in, rushes, looking for anybody, sees the PS5, is like, eh, they can wait. Oh, I'll, just, I'll just play a little Fortnite. I'll just play a little Persona 5 Royal on the PS5. Well, like, they can wait. <laughs> Enough. Not even close. Oh, oh, uh, call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for me! Yeah, pretty much, dude. Call an ambulance, but not for me. Oh, I love that joke. That's so good. That's basically just another version of the Uno Reverse card of the No You, but in a funnier way, honestly. Peace. Good morning. Haha, ha, I followed you, human. What? Oh no. Get him. Wait, what? No help. Oh. Please let me go, I'm sorry. Phew. Thank Titan he's gone. Is that bacon I smell? That was a little trippy, but I totally am on board for cooking Tibbles at any moment in time. Tibbles becomes bacon, I'm, I'm on board. I'm on board. That's all you need to say. Tibbles and bacon in the same sentence, I'm there. I'm there. See, this is why you're so useful, Luz. You're so desperate to help people. You even helped me meet the Collector. What? I didn't mean to. I thought I was doing something good. You did do something good. I thought this one was another lost cause. Because of you, we can finish our work as witch hunters, starting with them! That was actually really cool. Dude, they actually like reanimated like the whole thing. That was actually really cool. Dude, people put lots of effort into these entries. Oh my gosh. They like reanimated like the whole little confrontation. That was sick. Sup, Hunter? I'm Miss Flapdick, and I'm sad. I think I know how to help. It's time for me to finally use this book. Where did you find it? It's a long story. <laughs> Let me see. <gasps> Hunter, the magic words quick. Please, thank you. I'm sorry. Pardon me and excuse me. No. Of the magic words. Oh, right. Misco, Musco, Mickey, Mouse. <laughs> what? Art, you're vicious. Flagic. <laughs> On my Titan flat. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, there's so much. Oh, there's so much in this 30 seconds. Okay, so Luce uses the Gravity Falls book. If you've seen the last Owl House contest, you'll know this person ended in the last one. They made like a whole Marky Woo summoning video, which was crazy. And then in this video, it's like a sequel. They revive Flapjack with the power of Miska, <laughs> Miska Mickey Mouse. Freaking Mickey Mouse Clubhouse revives Flapjack and then Flapjack becomes this freaking dancing freaking chicken thing. <laughs> it just falls over and dies. <laughs> I don't know why that broke me so hard when it just fell over. Oh my gosh, I died, dude. I freaking died. That's such a good entry. God gives the hardest battles to his strongest soldiers. <laughs> when did I sign up for the war? When did I enlist? Honestly, dude, what the heck? Seriously. Poor Luz. Why did you gotta go through all this? I blame the writers.
That was decently well put together. I like that. That was a little scary, I gotta say. A little scary. Uh, I did have to cut out part of it because there's like a little blood included. But uh, if you want to go see the original version, you can check it obviously down in the description below. But that's pretty cool. That's a good entry. Okay. What does Y E S spell? Yes. What does E Y E S spell? Yes. <laughs> what does E Y E S spell? Yes. <laughs> What is happening? <laughs> what does Y E S spell? Yes. What does E Y E S spell? Yes. I love this meme so much, dude. I love the what the what is Y E S what, the eyes. You know, the joke is that it's eyes, obviously, but like, oh, it's so funny, dude. I love it. And having Hunter be like the blunt one who doesn't get it. That's so funny. Ah, oh, it's so perfect. This is actually really cool. I had to edit out the audio, unfortunately, but it's like doing little redrawing, and they even drew like flat back with the little blink there at the end. That's so sweet, dude. Aww, I hope that's what happened actually. That's so cute. They basically added on to that scene and gave Luce a friend. Oh, she really did need a friend like that. Oh, that was so cute. You'll never have her! And why is that? Because I love you. I just can't even. Help! Never fear for I. I got this. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. That's beautiful. Oh, yes, another classic Owl House's Vines. You'll love to see it. I like the little animatics though, they're so bouncy and fun and cute. Really nice. Wow, I'm in the demon realm. Welcome to the Owl House. Uh, I hate you. Do you want to go out with me? Do you want to go out with me? Heck yes. Death to all witches. Do you have any games on your phone? <laughs> Cringe. Wow, I did it. I'm finally back home with my mom in the human realm. Ready to return to the demon realm? Heck yes. I love this so much. I, dude, I, I, I gotta say it. I'm sorry. This is the best entry. This is it. My opinion, of course, but this, dude, like, look at the effort they put into this. Look at how well these puppets are made. The voices and like the little editing is so cute. The, why are they so well made? This is so good. And this the funnies and cringe, <laughs> just oh my gosh! I wish I could make content this good. This is hilarious. This is so cute. I would love to see more of this. This is actually my favorite entry so far. I love this so much, so freaking much. Oh, this is amazing. Literally god tier Owl House content right here. Aw, that's just so sweet. We really need more moments like that. Especially nowadays, oh my gosh. The good old days when Luce was actually happy. That was actually really cute. Yo, the effects? The effects with the light glyph? That was sick! That was
was so good. I wonder how much effort that took. Cause like, it, and then like they they cut it so perfectly, so they didn't have to like animate the the thing, the 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 paper clink crinkling up. Gosh, that was so well put together. That's so good. And then obviously you know you you fall in the lake because that's literally where it was. But <laughs> that's so good. Oh my gosh. Holy moly. Gosh, dude, there is some really strong entries in this contest. That's insane. Aww, that's just sad. You start off by showing Hunter and Flapjack all happy together, and then just death. So sad, dude. Oh my gosh, this art is chaotic. Oh my gosh. Well, besides the Lumini one, but let's just let the Bellows and Hootie moments. Oh my gosh. Such chaotic art. The, the fishing and the McDonald's. Like, oh my gosh, dude. That was some good art. That was pretty good. Oh my gosh, so this per this creator, I said there's like a little backstory, this creator is actually really interesting because they post art in the Discord server all the time, and they were the creators of that God Hoodie image that I posted on my community tab. They've also been drawing fan art of AI Amity, which looks really, really cool. By the way, I love the fan art of AI Amity, gotta say. And then seeing them enter in this, that's so good, dude. Like the lighting is so good. The freaking hunter getting possessed is terrifying. The possessed freaking Duolingo bird. Oh my gosh, that's what that's what got me though. And then starts speaking Spanish, dude, because the Duolingo bird was possessed by Bellows. That's so funny, dude. Oh my gosh. Gosh, that was really good though. That was so good. Oh yes, 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 yes. I love the Dr. Livesy, or Livesy, whatever it is pronounced says. I love this meme so much. Oh my gosh, it's so good. The freaking walk cycles, dude. Oh, it's so perfect. And Hunter, Gus, and Willow fits it pretty well. What? Emily, I am proud of you. Looks like you finally got into anime. This will be an enjoyable experience, since I will get into teach you how things work about the animation world. But Luz, this is an anime. These are the news. Dang, what now? Enough time to record, so final shot. Subscribe to Z. <laughs> Subscribe to Z. <laughs> oh gosh, that was actually crazy. So, wow, they're all like watching Frogvasion happen while they're on Earth. That's actually pretty funny. I don't know if like the times line up that that if they were like in the same canonical universe that'd actually be super interesting if like they got to see Frogvasion happen like from Amphibia. That would be so cool. That would actually be really really cool. That's a pretty silly edit. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't include the music because once again, it is copyrighted. Gosh darn that copyrighted music, but you know, it's the me or the PS5 meme I'm sure you've all heard before, but except with Hunter and Willow. Pretty good though, pretty good. It even fits because of the whole abridged joke. So Flatpak died, and now every time when I go to Hobby Lobby, all I see in the Christmas decorations are Flatpak, Flatpak, and Flatpak, and I have to be reminded. No, that's so depressing. Are you serious? Is that really what it's like out there? Oh my gosh, I should check my local Walmart to see if that's true. Okay, so that was actually really interesting. 
the Owl House characters as Naruto characters. I haven't actually seen Naruto, but that actually does look really cool. I know my sister's like super into Naruto, so she tells me about it. But that's actually really cool. I think it's V transforms into like the collector to scare loose and then gets a really solid hit on her, taking her down. That's pretty interesting. And even combining like the characters, like you combine Sasuke and V, that's actually a pretty good combination of both characters. I think I can handle a little pain. help, Luce. But I don't, I don't need you anymore. Well, it's not the common cold. I'm uh, unfortunately have to diagnose you with cringe. Your precious palisman, would you? Oh, but then again, I don't care what you want. Goodbye, Evelyn. No! <laughs> Oh my gosh, these were good. Oh gosh, the, the the best one, in my opinion, was the getting stabbed with the freaking Andreas sword. Oh my gosh, but the Markiplier one was so good. Markiplier screaming when freaking Flatbag dies, dude. That was basically me when that happened. And I'm sure a lot of you too. Billy, stop. Can't get a no. What the heck? What? Okay, these are some odd memes. The first one was strange. Hunter is getting lemonade, but he's also not half-existent. Uh, the Bellows making Hunter in Photoshop, I think, was the best one. <laughs> that one was pretty good. The emo house was just kind of scary. What the heck, dude? Uh, you'll never understand me. <laughs> And that, everybody, was our final entry. So now, you all know what time it is. It's time to take a look at the winners. So as always, this is the hardest part of the contest for me, is picking the winners. Because there's always so many good entries. Like, I have to choose 10 among so many of these entries, and that is really difficult for me to try and judge a quality. So as always, you know, this contest is mainly meant for fun, so I do want to take the time to thank everybody once again for entering because I really do appreciate it. I think it's really, really cool. It's not possible if people don't enter, so I really am grateful that all of you entered. And it does suck that I can't just give everybody the win, but we also have some honorable mentions that should be showing up on the screen right now, so congratulations to those honorable mentions. But now it is time for our winners. Our first winner is Fat Bird Coven, the creator of the Flipnote animated uh, Golden Guard Choir, which I really, really loved. I thought that was just so cool. It was really well animated, and the fact that it was done in Flipnote Studio really uh, gave it some nostalgia points. Maybe that's just a bit of a bias, but you know, I thought it was really, really cool. And it was super well done. They decided on a $20 prize, so that went straight to them. Our next winner is Ram Ham X. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Forgive me if I pronounce any of your names wrong. And they were the creator of the Hootie vs. Hunter animatic. I thought this was just so funny, dude. Oh my gosh, it was drawn so well. Hootie just comes out of nowhere, eats the PS5, and then Hunter just explodes. I don't know. I thought it was just so funny. And they decided on a shout out for their prize. So please check out their Instagram and YouTube. Link down in the description below. Our next winner is Egg Baby Official with the Snapcube shadow dubbed uh, audio with the whole gaslighting thing. That was just so funny. Super in character, you know, for Bellows. And I don't know, I've always been a huge fan of the Snapcube uh, Sonic fandom, so it, get, it got some bonus points with that. It was just really well made as well. You know, beautiful art. And they decided on a shout out, so you can check out their Tumblr and their Twitter down in the description below. Our next winner is Flamey, or Flamey again, sorry about the pronunciations. They were the creator of the little animatic with Gus and Hunter with the whole, uh, if your leg gets cut off, where are you gonna feel the pain? I, I love that, dude. I love that joke, it's so funny. And I don't know, I just thought this was really well put together. It was really cute. And for their prize, they also decided on a shout out, so you can check out their YouTube channel down in the description below. Our next winner is Unoriginal and Dumb, which is far from true. <laughs> They're the creator of the Willow and Hunter Grimwalker discussion animation, which I thought was really, really good. That was animated so well. I was very surprised to see something like that. I don't know, it really caught me off guard, which is how well done it was. And to save for college, they decided on a $20 prize, so I sent that straight to them. Our next winner is Julie Ghouls, the creator of that uh, loose dodging little animation thing, and then Hunter striking, and then does the freaking Family Guy death pose. It's like some trend, I'm not exactly sure what it's called, but I thought it was really well made. And unfortunately, they didn't respond to my email, 
but I still wanted to give them the win, so I'm shouting out their YouTube and their Instagram. So please check those down in the description below. Our next winner is Toaster Ant, the creator of uh, the Amity, or I guess Lucent Amity versus Hot Pop animation. That just, oh, it was so beautiful. Everything about it was so beautiful. The Hop Hop just coming out of the tree and saying, foolish child, is like one of the funniest things I've ever seen. I was dying of laughter after seeing that. And this person also comes to the streams on my gaming channel and they were telling me about their work in progress about this. So it was really fun to hear about how they worked on this. And for their prize, they decided on a shout out to their YouTube channel. So please check out their channel down in the description below. Our next winner is Dechi, the creator of the Just Like You. I know we had two of those but we have the one with Hunter and Bella specifically. I thought this one was like really, really good. They kind of had like their own ideas with Hunter as a child and the art that they had, the shading, the lighting was so good. They had stuff from Hollow Mine, Flapjack's Death. It was just all like crazy good. So I had to give them a win and they decided on a 30 second video for their prize. So let's take a look. Not exactly what I was expecting, but sure, we'll take it. I'll definitely link that down in the description below so you can go and check that out as well. <laughs> Our next winner, this seems like an obvious one, is The Dr. Cog, the creator of the Owl House Puppet Show. I personally think this is the best entry in the contest. I just think it's so good. Maybe it's just my personal bias, but I've always loved like, you know, fan-made puppets. And these ones were so well made. And the little jokes they had going into the video, it was just, you know, the presentation, everything was all S tier. I had to give them a win. And for their prize, they also decided on a 30 second video. So let's take a look. Hey everyone, it's me, King. And Hootie. Yes, and Hootie. We just wanted to say thank you so much for choosing the Dr. Cog's Owl House Puppet video as one of your winners. Make sure to subscribe to the Dr. Cog's YouTube channel because he's going to make more puppet videos. Hoot hoot! He's currently working on more puppets right now. Leave a comment telling us your deepest, darkest secrets. Where? That's right, everybody, you heard it here first. The Dr. Cox is going to be making more puppet videos. That's right, so please, please check out their YouTube channel. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I'm definitely gonna be the first one to see all those new puppet videos, I can't wait. And our final winner is PT, the creator of the How to Find Titan Blood skit. I was a big fan of this one just because of the presentation, how they had like the really cool effects with the light glyph, and then it turns into an arrow pointing to the Titan blood, and, and they go out and try and find it fall in the lake, and it's like, oh, I found it. <laughs> I thought it was just so cool. You know, the effects are really awesome. It was really, really well made. I had to give them the win, dude. I just had to. And for their prize, they also decided on a 30 second video. So let's take a look. Hi, PT here. So I won the contest. And first, I'd like to say thanks for that win and opportunity to make that project. It was really nice. Of course, congrats for the other winners. I haven't seen the projects yet, but I'm sure they are amazing. Also, I want to invite you guys to my channel. I make mostly comics, but I want to change it a little soon, so yeah, you can check this out. And like I said, there you are. That's right, everybody. You can go check out PT's channel for even more awesome content. I can't wait to see what else they're going to create. Honestly, I'm looking forward to it. If it's anything like what we saw in this contest video, I can't wait to see what else they're going to create. So please go check out their channel. And with that, everybody, that brings the Owl House video contest to a close. I apologize that it took so long to come out. I ran into quite a few different setbacks, so it was delayed quite a bit. So I apologize for that. But it's finally here, and I hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you once again to all the creators who submitted, and thank you all for watching, everybody. I really do appreciate it. And if you're watching this right when it comes out, happy holidays. I hope you enjoy the holiday time and have a good time with your friends and family. And with that, once again, thanks for watching. I'll see you all later, everybody. Have yourselves a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.